Hello everybody and welcome back to Skip Allen Paints. This is a series of videos about what's new in Painter X3 or Painter 13. <laughs> okay, so um, what we want to talk about this time is the Enhanced Stroke Preview. Now, some of the control panels have changed a bit. And this first one that I'm going to bring out, Stroke Preview, has changed. It only shows the stroke preview on it. And right now I have on a blender, so that's going to look kind of odd to you. Let's go to acrylics. And if I go up to uh, the first one, bristle brush, you'll start to see how the, the uh, stroke preview looks. The actual stroke that the brush makes will be in gray. We won't see it in its in the current color anymore. It will be in gray. And then this background stuff is giving you an opportunity to see what the brush does as it goes through uh, some background uh, material. That's not necessary on every brush uh, to have that. For instance, the capt captured bristle. Uh, you're getting an idea of how it works just based on seeing uh, the bristle itself. Now, these are really quite useful. Uh, and you will see them not only in the stroke preview, but you will see them inside of the uh, brush library panel. So if I, here's your stroke preview and your uh, dab preview. So as I hover over each one of these brushes or variants, you will see what the stroke preview looks like. Also, we've already talked about brush searching and let's go ahead and and bring up all the new brushes for X3 and if you'll notice here's your stroke preview down here and so as you go through the list here you will see the stroke preview um, as you hover over a particular variant. Very cool extra additional information for all of us. Okay, that's it on this one. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.